Many people have seen the Rocky franchise and wondered there is absolutely no way this could have happened in real life. The corner, Balboa's back in the corner, but here comes Balboa! Keep it on! I'm standing there! That guy's great! No, no, listen, he's only a man. You can beat him because you're a tank. You're a greasy, fast, 200 pound Italian tank. Go to him! Run over him! Okay. A lot of the print reporters and broadcast reporters who are here close to us in the media section at uh, the MGM Grand are worried as he prepares for this assignment. They believe that he's risking too much. The fight between Naoya Inoue and Nonito Donaire, saying that this fight will be the retirement fight for Nonito Donaire. He is the underdog in this fight. Naoya Inoue is the heavy favorite. A lot of people are picking Inoue to win. What's your prediction for the fight? Prediction? Yeah, my pain. Upcoming fight. No need to in there. Anyway. Uh, anyway, yeah, yeah. I, I got I got Japanese kid anyway. He arguably, you know, my top on the pound for pound list is destroying world champions. He's the best of the best and he, you know, getting them out of there within, you know, two to three rounds. So you know. No need to in there. Anyway. In a way? Yeah, anyway. The monster? <laughs> I'm gonna go with the monster. Younger fighter. I think he wants it more. Donito, Donito Nero was a good fighter, but I think it's uh, past his time. So I'm gonna go with the monster. Oh, no way, my God. That's my that's my favorite fighter right now. That's my favorite fighter. So that's what we going with. I don't even know how to pronounce it, but that's my favorite fighter. But this is not the typical case where the old guy is being fed to the young guy first round, but it hasn't happened. Oh, huge left hook. Just his technique, it's certainly not what he has left physically, it's the fighting part. I don't think there's a soul in the arena who believed that... Got up from being knocked down, it was a tough knockdown, got caught in the body. Um, you know, you can obviously tell that he was hurt from it, and he was able to get back up and, you know, kept fighting. That round, round 11, is definitely a candidate for round of the year. The fight is a candidate for fight of the year. Was going to become a serious candidate for fight of the year. Yet it is. After surviving the Filipino Flash, we'll go on to put on one of the greatest shows, taking the young fighter to school and proving to all the spectators and boxing writers that this fight is not a mesh match. I compare this to Rocky's bout against Mason Dixon. Rocky faced similar backlash from the media. Talk about wishful thinking. Well, maybe no hopes is more realistic. Anyway, the crowd likes it. Look at the Italian stallion. Cool and relax. Rocky's an off the board underdog, and they don't care at all. Put him up. You are a crazy old man. Look at that. Let's go. Good job training and courage. Knock this bum out, Mace! Yes. You said to the kid, it ain't about how hard you hit, it's about how hard you can get hit and keep moving forward, how much you can take and keep moving forward. Get up. Let's go, get up! Both Rocky and the Filipino Flash will put on a great performance. Like what Jim said, he may have lost the fight, but he surely won the event. Winner of the event. He proved himself in a way that none of us dreamed could be the case. Of the Filipino Flash, Bonito Donaire.